Uh, one second. Okay. What's going on, guys? Today we're going to be learning how to play Back to School by Deftones. It's another pretty easy one. Um, not too hard at all. Hardest part is, like, the intro, and the intro is not even that hard. So, um, yeah, it's in C, drop C, sorry. And, um, yeah, like, pretty much all of White Pony. If you want to know how to get to, uh, drop C from standard tuning, then you can just go watch my RX Queen tutorial, and I, uh, show how to do it in that one. But, um, yeah, no. So, it's pretty easy. Let's go ahead and get into it, I guess. Um, so we're going to start off down here, <laughs> pretty high up in the neck. And you're going to put your pinky on 13 of the high E. Index finger on the, sorry, 10th fret of the G. And then middle finger on the 12th fret of your D string. And you're going to play that. And you're not going to play anything else, just... take your uh, middle finger off and take your index finger and move it down so it's on the 10th fret of the B string so all you should hear now is um, open D open G and then 9 sorry 10 on the B and then 13 on the high E so yeah pretty easy uh, skip back if you have to, so that's 13, 9, 12. Yeah. Okay, so that's the intro, and then, um, I'm not gonna put on distortion so you can just really hear the notes separately, but, um, I don't know, maybe at some point I will you know, and then you're gonna go on your, uh, 8th fret, sorry, blanked for a second, 8th fret of your, uh, E, A, and D string, so, A, O. But whenever you do it, like whenever you're doing the open, you do A, my bad, A, that second chord, the uh, 10 on the B and then 13 on the high E. Sorry, I'm kind of at a weird angle here. My guitar is like, instead of against my body, it's kind of outward, but anyways. And then we get into the riff that goes along to the uh, the verses, and that's five five four four A A open. Now, whenever you play them, you're gonna make kind of shake it a little bit. into the chorus. The chorus is really easy. So you're going to take your index, or sorry, not index, ring finger and put it on the uh, tenth fret of your G string. Take your index finger and you're going to bar the E, A, and D strings with it and play that. All you should hear is this. Down, 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 up, down, up. So. And then open just these top three strings. And then that same chord we just did, but move it down to the fifth fret. And then four. Yeah, 
that. So it's a uh, pretty simple. And then I'm um, trying to think of what else there is. There's really not a whole lot left. I think there's one part where uh, in the chorus, or he's... Oh, I can't remember. Sorry, but it's 9, 12, 5. My bad, sorry. 9, not 9, 8, A. That's during the second chorus, and then after that, after the uh, second chorus, he does. And then it pauses, and then it goes back. What you can do is, uh, just take your ring finger and slide it to the nine. When you do your open, it kind of gives that. I don't know, it sounds pretty good, but I don't do that really just because, I don't know. I just don't. But, yeah, I mean, that's really the whole song. It's not a hard song at all, so, um. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys next time.